It's a great pleasure for me to introduce this sanctuary hospital, hospital clinic in the downtown Barcelona with more than 100 years ago of history, focus on different areas with a very strong research uh, department. We are really good on organ transplantation. We start the first kidney transplantation more than 50 years ago. And we also do pancreas transplantation, liver transplantation and heart transplantation. Hospital Clinic has also a private structure, the name is Barna Clinic, in which we can attend national and international patients, including renal transplantation. The Clinical Institute of Nephrology and Urology in Hospital Clinic in Barcelona is a center of reference for many kidney diseases, particularly also innovation in kidney transplantation. Our mission is to offer kidney patients the best therapeutic solutions according to the standard of care and according to the innovation and experience that we have in our center. It is crucial for the kidney patient to receive at every stage of the kidney disease an adapted therapy at every moment. So that means our department is strong also in clinical nephrology and also in dialysis services uh, with international leadership in state-of-the-art technology. That means that the patient can reach transplantation in the best clinical condition. The first kidney transplantation ever done in Spain was done in this hospital in 1965. This was thanks to the strong collaboration between urologists and nephrologists at that time. But this collaboration has been continued until today. Now we have the Institute of Nephrology and Urology and the Renal Transplantation Unit and this is a representation of this strong collaboration. During the last 50 years, we've done more than 5,000 uh, kidney transplants. Uh, we've been uh, achieving uh, the best uh, results in outcome, both for grafts and kidneys patients. And on the other hand, we have introduced over many novelties in uh, both uh, surgical and uh, immune uh, therapies. Minimal invasive surgery is in the DNA of our hospital. We've been uh, introducing laparoscopy um, in the last 20 years uh, for any type of urological uh, surgery. And on top of that, uh, in the last three years, we have introduced robotic kidney transplant that I think this is the most disruptive change in uh, transplant surgery uh, from the very beginning of the uh, transplant in, uh, in the history. Uh, already I have three transplants in my body and um, the third one was two weeks ago and the donor was my father and um, it's the best gift I can receive for him so now I'm recovering very well I'm very happy and I must say I'm very um, comfortable I'm sure because I'm surrounded by the very best team here in the Hospital Clinico that they are always um, looking for the best practices for me and for all the patients that are with the same disease as me and all is under control. Transplantation has come a long way during the last decades. However, a lot of transplanted kidneys are still lost during the lifetime of the patient. So we're working on making transplanted kidneys longer by pharmacological therapies and also by cell therapies. Moreover, one of uh, our research focuses is uh, the ex vivo management of kidneys to be transplanted, preservation techniques, and also to make untransplantable kidneys transplantable. And we're also working on giving access uh, to transplantation for those patients who are difficult or impossible to transplant, either to anatomical vascular problems or also to uh, uh, problems uh, with HLA incompatibility or blood group incompatibility. Kidney and urinary tract diseases are becoming more and more prevalent and this is because the life expectancy of our population is increasing, more elderly patients are surviving and we will see in the future more and more kidney diseases and diseases uh, that affect the urinary tract. The future is in one way prevention, preventing all the diseases, preventing all the risk factors they can put the patient on risk of having any kind of disease, particularly kidney diseases in my case.
But prevention is also to offering our patients the best therapeutic option at every moment. Our goal is, is innovation, so what we are trying to do is to incorporate new technologies, new innovation for uh, treating all the diseases for our patients and offering all the people in the world the possibility to be treated by our professionals.